I use remote play to stream. And when I logged in today, basically there was an update that I was forced to do. I didn't know this was going to be a new problem, but it is. Uh, luckily, I did find another new method to fix it. Long story short, when you log into remote play, the, the banner uh, is not there yet. Let me log in real quick. When you log into remote play, it says remote play connected at the top of the screen and I could not get it off. Old method used to be that you change the, the language, but that doesn't work anymore. So I tried it. Actually, let me move this real quick. It's in the way you can't see it. I also make these graphics if you're looking to buy one for your stream. But anyways, you see how at the top it says remote play connected. I used to be able to change the language to get it removed, but somehow they patched it for, I couldn't tell you why, but you know, they did. But fortunately I did find a new way to get it removed. It's not the ideal way because long story short, it doesn't exactly help what I was originally doing, but it should help you if you're using remote play it should be no problem let me get right into it so first let me log in with my computer click over here log in i don't have my controller connected to the computer yet go ahead and log in so it does say remote play connected now in order to take it off before connecting it see it's not connected you go over here I was already logged into this account with this controller. Um, but if you if you need to, here, let me turn this off. Either way works, but I'm just showing you just in case, depending on how you log in. So when you log in, what you wanna do is before this is connected to the computer, make sure you assign it to a different profile, not your remote play profile, not the one that you're gonna be using for remote play, okay? So you go up to your account and then log out. Now, when you log out, you see it's removed and now I'm back to my remote play profile. And then now when you're gonna to wanna to do your remote play or streaming or whatever, now you plug it in wait for it to turn on and now you got it you're able to play uh through the computer with the controller without that banner up at the top i'm getting a phone call hold on one sec again uh like i said it doesn't exactly help me because what i was doing was i was logging into remote play and then using my controller on that second account that way i don't have to plug it in at all and then i can just directly connect to my playstation so that there's no input delay i do stream a lot of madden so having that little millisecond of input lag does you know sometimes can result in interceptions or you know missed tackles or whatever um but I tried playing with that remote clip, uh, remote play connected message at the top of the screen and it just wasn't working. I couldn't see the score. I couldn't see how much time was left in a game. I couldn't even see the down and distance. It made it almost unplayable. So really they got to fix it. But in the meantime, if you could deal with that little bit of input delay, this, this works. I see it. It definitely works. And you know, hopefully this helps. Um, yeah, hopefully it helps, man. Uh, wait. Yeah, hopefully it helps. Let me know if you have any other fixes, but um, if this helped you, also drop a comment. Let me know.